Hello YouTube and welcome to our video number 9 in our HTML CSS tutorial for beginners. In this video we're gonna finally uh, make a uh, get an image to our page and actually after we get an image and we add it to the page we were gonna create the link so our image could take us to some other website if we want to or within our own website so first thing what we need to do we obviously we need to go uh, either we need to get the uh, image from our own computer and get it to the folder where we add or what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to Google Chrome I'm gonna open up Google and I'm gonna type here let's say Google yeah so I type in Google and but I want images and here is the Google image that I want so what I do is I'll do the save image as and I'm gonna write Google but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna save it in the desktop in the brackets where the rest of our two files are so far we have two and by default it's gonna add the extension to it so save I can easily close this and right now we have Google you can see that we have that image here so the way we add images to our website is we write a tag and the tag would be EMG and then we write source and then we equal and double double quotes and then we press here because brackets allows us right away to uh, find the when our image and he can you can actually see the preview of the image so you can you close it here and then um, you close the tag and now you we have actually a image that is on our site okay and once we once we reload the page we have the image on the page so obviously you can add as many images as you want or uh, as little as possible that's really up to you um, but the trick here is really get it here to your um, folder so you don't need to start searching through many different folders and, and, and where it exactly is and, and how it works and another thing that we're going to do today so let's say well we have a dumb old photo okay well image what's it good at so we what we could do is we actually could could combine the things that we learn and we could make a link to an image so once we click an image we actually go somewhere so what we do is we close this out and close here and now our image is actually a link so what we need to write is the same thing that we wrote before that is equal to and then we write http google.com and save this we got that preview refresh the page and now you can see that as we're hovering over Google it actually um, turns our, our, our mouse clicker turns differently so once we press here we obviously go directly to Google and that is how you add an image to the page that is how you add a link to an image so you could obviously if it's your website you can create your own images and maybe put your own head there or anything like that and actually use them as images you don't have to do uh, you don't have to create a link to every image you have but it's definitely a very neat feature to use uh, thank you very much guys for watching this video I'll see you in the next video